Welcome back. It's Friday and another episode of the KJ and Kirby Food Review. We always have a lot of fun bringing you new, interesting, exciting, weird, bizarre foods that you might find in your local grocery store. Some of it we get imported. You might not necessarily find it here, but we just like to experience it for you and maybe give it an early try. And then you might want to rush out and buy it for yourself. And it's starting to catch on because yesterday I went uh, shopping for a certain item and uh, the lady at the store was like, is this for the KJ and, and Kirby food review? And I was like, yeah, actually. So, I mean, people people love this. So well, that's she, good. Well, she better gave it to you for free then. She actually did. What? We got it free. We're getting free stuff now. Yay. Yeah, We don't look for free stuff, but if no. it happens, it's all good. Okay. Well, you know, guys, I can't believe that we've gone almost through the entire month of May and we haven't celebrated Kirby's birthday. Okay. Okay, it's a little late, I know, but we're gonna celebrate Kirby's birthday today with a brand new product from our friends at Oreo. I love Oreo. But this isn't just any Oreo, this is the Oreo birthday cake ice cream sandwich. Oh, fancy. I love it. Okay, so you wanna try it out? Yeah. Okay, hang on, hang on a sec here, hang on, hang on. Where's your, do you have a, do you have a Flicker, fire maker? Oh, uh, hang on here. Um, yes. Okay. Yay. Sorry. Put your lattice in the air. Wave them like you just don't. Hang on. Oh, jeez. This is a big deal. There it is. Happy birthday <laughs> to Kirby. <laughs> this is a, Are we going to set off a fire just, alarm here? After the week we had with the studio issues, I feel like we just got to play it careful here. Happy birthday. We still got about blow it out. 20 seconds there. No, you can try to blow this out. Again? Nothing happens. Well, that's no good. These are so awesome. Oh, great. Now, how am I going to get this out without burning my hand? Okay, hang on. Ah, crap. <laughs> okay, there we go. You're good. You're good. All right, we're good. We're golden. Let's okay. cut this sucker in half and okay. let's try out the Oreo birthday cake ice cream sandwich. Ooh, look at this. There you go. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Happy birthday. Mm. Okay, so obviously, mm. when we're talking about an ice cream sandwich, it's not crunchy Oreo like the cookie. So it's kind of soft. Yeah. It's got little colorful bits in there that you may or may not be able to see. But I love it. These are so good. I highly suggest brushing with Sensodyne mm -hmm. before eating these because my teeth are hurting. But good. Really good. There you go. Birthday cake Oreo. One more little bite. Okay. <laughs> Next up, save mine on the KJ and Kirby food review. Next up, we have some more Oreos because who doesn't love Oreos, what? right? More. A listener this week uh, swung by the studio. Don't know who they are, but they dropped these off because we were talking about them on uh, on air. So you've probably seen them around. These s'mores. Oh no way! Oreos, yes way. Oh, wait, hang on. Screenshot. Hold it up. Oh, hang on. No, I want to do a different screen. I want to put them on my eyes. <laughs> See? Okay, wait, wait, wait. We'll do this. Ready? Screenshot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so one for you. One for me. Weird. Okay, so... And look, at, it's a it's a graham cracker flavored cookie. Okay, so... With marshmallow and chocolate. I got to break it open. I, I just can't do this Is without... that how you eat it? Because there's so many ways okay, to eat so an Oreo. You've got the chocolatey thing there. Yeah. And then, of course, you've got the white in there that's supposed to take, taste like a marshmallow. Yeah. All right. Okay. It does taste very graham crackery. Well, imagine you're at a campfire and you're eating these. It is no substitute for an actual s'more. No. I'll tell you that right now. I mean, maybe if you heated it up. However... You know, maybe just a little, quick little snack and, uh, you yeah. know, you have them in the cupboard and you're like, yeah, I love s'mores. They're good. It's a nice substitute, but you're not going to want to bring these camping necessarily and say, forget the campfire, forget the chocolate, forget the marshmallows. We're having these instead. Yeah. No, no. You'll no. disappoint people. Yeah. And nobody likes to be disappointed. <laughs> I know this. There we go. <laughs> there you go. That is the okay. s'mores Oreo. So... It's Friday, and we've had a very stressful week um, and month. And uh, so, what do uh, what do KJ and Kirby like to do when we've had a very stressful week? Fight? Um, no, we don't fight. Wrestle? Uh, no, no. no. Um, 
we like to drink. So Oh yes, of course we do. <laughs> so we're going to drink. So this is obviously for 18 and older people and for 19 and older in Saskatchewan. Um these are the new Molson Canadian ciders. And so yesterday I went to the co-op liquor store and got us some. So we shall crack open a can. Thanks, co-op. There right. we go. There's your own can. So, oh, should we just do one for now? Okay. Okay, so now they do have a number of flavors. Look at that. I got Oreo on my, on my thumb. <laughs> so they come in a number of flavors. By the way, have you seen these? Do you know do you guys know what these are? These are uh solo cups. But they're red the, solo cups. Yeah, the solo, but these are different. Fill me up. I don't know. The you, song. you peel off the thing there and it reveals a little chalkboard. Fantastic. And you can scratch your knee. Yeah, we can. On there. Curbs. Uh, all right. Okay. Okay. So I, I assume this is an apple thing. Yeah, this they come in two flavors. One uh one's kind of like an orchid orchid. Orchid uh peach. Orchard. Uh, yeah, orchid, whatever. Anyways. <laughs> Mm -hmm. And uh, and this one's the apple cider. So Molson Canadian cider is proudly made with apples that are 100% Canadian grown, delivering a crisp apple taste that's refreshing to the core. Best served over ice. Oh my to God, the these core. are cold. Do you get it? <laughs> Anyways, uh, it's it's very manly to drink cider. Um, the lady at the co-op assured me of that. She wanted you to know that. A lot of men drink cider, so it's okay. No judgment. All right, let's try it. Okay. Looks like beer. Well, that's good. That's good. Smith, for, oh, yes, sorry. We don't want to get I'll drunk yet. Rest later. <laughs> we still have a meeting. <laughs> All right. Okay, so it's it's nice and frothy, like a like a beer would be. Yeah, it does smell like beer. All right. And you're right. It does have kind of a beerish. But it, smell you can to smell it. the you can smell the apple. The apples are there too. Okay, this is my first Cheers. time trying cider. Oh, do you like that? I do. It's not an overpowering apple taste. Like it's not like apple juice or whatever. No, the no. apple's a little more subtle, and you can kind of it's it's like it's like probably a third apple and maybe an eighth beer. I don't even know what you'd say the rest is. That math doesn't even add up. Never mind. <laughs> but you know what? It's like a nice drink to have on a patio. You know, after a long, long week of work, and uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> and it's a nice refreshing drink. I think. All right. So I, I bet the peach one's really good too. So this is the apple. Maybe next week we'll do the peach, but regardless though, uh, I like it. I totally worth going out, maybe getting a four pack of the new Molson Canadian yes. cider. All right, cider. there you go. That's been another episode of the KJ and Kirby Food Review. We've been talking about Oreo s'mores, uh, birthday cake, Oreo ice cream sandwich, and of course, cider with Molson Canadian. Have a great day, guys. Keep safe, lock your doors. Mm -hmm.